we need to take some initiatives to protect wildlife around us. Do you agree with me? Let's begin our journey. The tufted titmouse is a small songbird from North America, a species in the tit and chickadee family. These small birds are approximately 6 inches in length, with a white front, and grey upper body outlined with rust-coloured flanks. Other characteristics include their black foreheads, and the tufted grey crest on their heads. The song of the tufted titmouse is usually described as a whistled peter peter peter, although this song can vary in approximately 20 notable ways. Now, let's listen to them. Beautiful, isn't it? Its habitat is deciduous and mixed woods as well as gardens, parks, and shrublands. Although the tufted titmouse is non-migratory and originally native to the Ohio and Mississippi River basins, factors such as bird feeders have caused these birds to occupy a larger amount of territory across the United States and stretching into Ontario, Canada. The tufted titmouse gathers food from the ground and from tree branches. It eats berries, nuts, insects, small fruit, snails, and seeds. Caterpillars constitute a major part of its diet during the summer. Titmice will stash food for later use. The titmouse can demonstrate curiosity regarding humans, and sometimes will perch on a window ledge and seem to be peering into the house. It is a regular visitor around bird feeders. Tufted titmice nest in a hole in a tree, either a natural cavity, a human-made nest box, or sometimes an old woodpecker nest. They line the nest with soft materials, sometimes plucking hair from a live animal such as a dog. If they find snake skin sheddings, they may incorporate pieces into their nest. The lifespan of the tufted titmouse is approximately two years, although it can live for more than 10 years. On average, these birds will have a clutch size of five to seven eggs. Unlike many birds, the offspring of tufted titmice will often stay with their parents during the winter, and even after the first year of their life. Sometimes, a bird born the year before will help its parents raise the next year's young. Will you be back soon? If you can, please spread the word. Good luck and bye.